Out to his base, Dino Barker in this one, getting his chance. Barker will he's had a third and a last place. So David seeing what he can do, he did very well at the county ground when, when he's brought in to replace Martin Dugard. He's coming off gate number four, Per Johnson off three, Joe Screen off two, and Jorgen Johansson off gate number one. And it is Jorgen who's made a fine start and he's leading the way. Per Johnson when he's at the back, what a surprise this is. Per not really getting the grip for this track this evening. Johansson when he's coming under some pressure now from David Mullet with Joe Screen in third and the Reading Racer number one, he's at the back. So Yogi as he's known down at Wimborne Road, really is fast making a name for himself and he's leading David Mullet and Joe Screen in this one. He did quite well at Exeter, he scored eight seven from his six rides and he's Getting off to a good race in heat number seven. He's leading the way as we say that. But Per Johnson, he's set somersaulted over his machine. He's crashed through into the safety fence. And what an unusual sight to find Per on the ground. Let's take another look and see exactly what happened to him. Well, we can see again it's Johansson out in front. Screen and Mullet vying for second place. But watch what happens here to Per Johnson. He just loses control and somersaults over his machine. Bad looking for for the number one for Sweden. We do hope he's okay. Well, thankfully he's able to get back to his feet. First aid, just seeing, making sure he is okay. And well, he's smiling at least. That's good. His Reading teammate coming to see exactly how he is.